Hello and welcome to our France. How can I help you today? Hello. I'm going to Las Vegas. I'm an elite member. Please upgrade me. Certain sir. You are upgraded to premium economy.
thiệt quá to Luxor which is very close to Mandalay Bay where they hand out the hand face um, so let's see where we end up I don't actually have money with me now because everything is behind me I bought a lot of a uh, lot of um, chandeliers there um, I hope everyone understands what does it mean. But the gist of it that I don't have money in my pocket right now. So it's gonna be a little bit of a miracle if I didn't make anything. But um, anyhow, that's Luxor. Luxor for sure. The old faithful Luxor. Mm. That smell, I, I miss that smell of Luxor. Yeah. Talk to you in a bit. So there's one thing which is like just a, a little, well, trick or tip or trick or whatever. You walk out from uh, the Luxor and like uh, you go towards Mandalay Bay you will find in this atrium right up there an Amazon locker where you can like order stuff from Amazon so if you are like a visitor like me and you don't have an American address but you'd like to shop some little stuff I don't know so no groceries or anything but like luggage weight or whatever uh, you can ask uh, to be delivered here in the locker and they keep it for three days uh, you can absolutely use your foreign card as well to order it works um, it's called recover so the locker's name is Amazon Recover and you just walk like that if you don't want to walk inside I actually cannot find the way like there's a second trip I cannot find a way for uh, this uh, elevated walkway between Luxor and Mandalay Bay where all the shops are I'm gonna put this on my agenda to look for this uh, this uh, this walkway how to access it anyway you walk just like that you enter here to Mandalay Palace place sorry the shops at Mandalay place you open it and the locker is there 
You scan the barcode here, enter the code, it opens and uh, you get your stuff. Easy as that. Cheers everybody. So let's uh, let's find out the original way of getting here without getting uh, getting a cold outside as it is chilly. So there's the locker and there's the walkway. Sorry, the escalator, the moving escalator, or however you call it, um, to this uh, Monday shops thing, which used to like connect, or I don't know, maybe still connects Luxor to Mandalay Bay. This place here actually was before 2022 and stuff uh, when I could come back. An actual COVID center for MGM employees, interestingly. Before I think it was a recruit center for MGM employees, but anyhow. So this way, you should end up at Luxor. And this other way should end up at uh, the Handelay Pay. I'm sorry, the Mandalay Bay. But let's uh, not go into Mandalay Bay tonight because gambling wise, I'm not sure what what end up in the in the vlog. But so yeah, not good, not good. But I dodged the bullet, and I'm actually up, so I can say that I'm up for the trip. But you know the trip is long, 21 days, anything, anything can change. But so far so good, <laughs> right? I'm here for like 5 hours now, I'm up for like 60 hours now, but yeah, so far I'm up, gambling wise. Anyhow, we will be going to Mandalay Bay for sure, but let's see how we can get back to Luxor oh by the way I haven't noticed but I haven't mentioned but um, I picked up the package well, I won't show here because that's a delicate gift for someone someone very important uh, first thing I crossed out from my uh, from my list Luxor. <coughs> Let's see where we end up because from the Luxor side the usual entrance is actually blocked, which is this one. So there should be a walking escalator here, but uh huh. Okay, so now I understand I think how we can get here. Actually you need to go up to the to the second floor where the um, Titanic and Buddy's exhibitions are and where this new playground is which will be opening in a couple of days actually we can maybe take a, a peek well yeah okay whatever it's all over the news that some other old, old playground is opening up but I don't know what's the concept here I literally have no idea, as someone would say. Anyhow, now I understand where the entrance to the Mandalay Bay is. Uh, we crossed it out from our list, and let's hope that, uh, like everything, will be crossed out from that list that quickly, because um, then we are very efficient. On the other hand, we won't have anything to do later on, which is not good. But whatever. Welcome back to Luxor, everybody. Cheers. Talk to you later. But the next thing on the agenda, after like 50 hours, 60 hours of being up and traveling and shit, to. Um, finally get some rest and that possibility is in New York, New York which is rather far from here but I'm not saying it's not manageable but first get something to eat something quick not so expensive even though I have the $600 resort credit to burn but I will start soon to 
bar naming. And for that idea, I have go to the Luxor, um, the deli. It should be open 24 7. And they have some decent burgers, and it's ready very quickly. And I believe we need to go that way, and with the cashier turn the right, and in the corner there should be our deli. I'm not even sure if it's called the deli actually. It's a very basic burger and fast food place, and they accept really large credit uh, room charges. So. Yeah, so that's next on the agenda. That's the buffet what we need to avoid by, by any chance possible. Don't go to the Luxo buffet, it's bad. But uh, yeah, that's the place, Backstage Deli, that's the name. Because I guess it's at the backstage of this standard steakhouse. It's Lot's world, as someone would say. I'm not. So that's our place. We're gonna pick up the pick up a burger here and uh, bring it back to New York, New York, and uh, enjoy it responsibly. Cheese, everybody. It is almost ready. The basic just call your number. You go pick it up or eat it here, as others are doing. And enjoy it. It's really a decent meal, you know. So I got the goods. And now I've been back to New York, New York. And the way to head back there, if you imagine the the map is like, you know, Luxor, then Excalibur, then there's Tropicana and uh, you need to cross Tropicana and enter New York, New York. Now, New York, um, I mean, Luxor is a kind of a maze in itself. You can, as with all the casinos, you can easily get, um, how would I say, confused of uh, where you are and where you want to go. But with Luxor, it's actually very easy to get to like to the Excalibur walkway. You just need to go to the wall like this. You just, just walk next to the Luxor wall, and then you like reach Starbucks here. You know that you are already in the kind of the good direction. Because next to Starbucks is like the very end of the casino place and uh, that's an actual wall there. Well, not a wall because actually there are rooms here. I don't know who would stay in these rooms, but uh, I'm not for sure. But anyway, when you reach uh, that place, you just turn right and follow the wall here and go straight. And it will be on your left very soon. There are some shops here as well, but if you want to avoid the casino action and don't want to get confused more than how you would, and you will, because this is how these casinos are made, you just follow the way to Starbucks next to the wall. And when you cannot go further, just turn and then here you are at the Excalibur walkway now it's also very interesting that if you go forward in that direction you will actually reach the Luxor Tower Valley and rideshare pickup so if you see anywhere like the I think it's I'm not sure if it's called North Wallet, but for sure Tower Wallet. Um, then it's there, down there. Anyways, to Excalibur, we go. As we cross the non working walkway, which is always the case in Las Vegas, it's very 
interesting and um, almost a festivity if all the workers are working as at least uh, one of them is usually not working if there's a pair of workers next to each other uh, in this case none of them are working actually but mm. so as we walk we pass these uh, whatever I don't know who would use these as well but anyways just one more set of escalators and you end up in the food court of uh, Excalibur So back in the room in New York, New York. So that's the food. It would have cost like nineteen dollars after tax. It's it's decent, you know. It's okay. Um, but it was free because it's a uh, room charge and it goes uh, goes down from my resorts credit. So oh, that that's that's not included. This one. Cheers, everybody.
Bob. Yep. Yeah.